vlogs about my trips and also everything about fashion. So now that the summer is gone and I'm not traveling that much, I have way more time to prepare and show you guys everything about fashion. In my fashion vlogs, I do try-ons. I show you all my new items and how I wear everything and also give you some tips and hopefully you get some inspiration. I hope you really enjoy this vlog with me today because what I'm about to show you, I'm really sure you're gonna like it. I prepared six outfits of how to style leather trousers. Three of them are going to be more dressy and the other three are going to be more casual for those days that you just want to be cozy and comfortable. So let's go ahead and get started. For this first look, I decided to wear something more dressy. I wanted an outfit where I can go to work in it, but also be able to wear it outside. Like those days where you have to go somewhere before work or even after. I wore a shirt that doesn't have structure and a tighter jacket on top. By wearing something oversized and a tighter jacket on top makes the outfit more balanced and you also look more feminine. As I always say, it's really good to balance the outfit. You don't want to wear everything from head to toes. Tight. As you can see, I have the leather leggings that they are really tight. The jacket is really feminine and tight, but I wore something oversized underneath where you can still see the silhouette. this outfit. I don't know if you guys live on your trainers, but I do. Obviously, there is days that I really feel like dressing up and looking more girly, but if there is no reason to dress up, why don't create an outfit where you can feel comfortable but also look good? What I did here, I added a statement jacket to break a little bit the black and white. Just a short sleeve t-shirt and a bomber jacket and you're ready to go. trousers always make the outfit dressier but how to break it from simple to edgy i wore a see-through long sleeve t-shirt that is shorter from the front and longer from the back there is something i don't like doing with leather leggings and is to wear short tops with it trousers they're fine but leggings i don't really recommend it normally leggings are really tight and thin and they show everything and sometimes we don't really want to show everything. In this case I was wearing a short t-shirt which is only from the front, at the back was longer and I wore a strappy white and grey blazer on top. And again everything is black so I broke the black with the blazer. And this outfit is perfect for dinner or to go out.
back to comfortable that top is from Topshop and I think it's really cute that little corset that makes your waist smaller and again wearing black and white break it with a colorful handbag and don't be scared of colors the trick is to know how to carry it if you are confident and you love what you're wearing people will love it as well this outfit is perfect for those Sunday afternoon where you're just gonna go for a walk and feel comfortable you can also wear it with a short or longer jacket and also really good with a denim jacket favorite outfits it looks really smart but I'm really comfortable because I'm wearing flat boots and a basic graphic t-shirt and I just put on top a thin khaki jacket that has a shape of a shirt but it's actually a really thin jacket I bought it long time ago I can't even remember where I bought it from I remember it was in Spain but I have no idea where I bought it from and I still love it it has been more than four years now it's a really simple outfit, but if you play a little bit with the colors, you can make re something really nice. I wore a white bag because I wanted to give a little bit of brightness to the outfit, but you can wear black, green, beige, anything. Be creative. least the most comfortable outfit it's a really simple outfit doesn't have that much layering I just wore a chunky boots that I matched with the handbag and an oversized hoodie it's a really comfortable outfit for those days that you just need to go somewhere quickly or go to the shop and also it can be a really good outfit for the airport and of course exactly the same outfit you can just change the hoodie and wear a sweater or a jumper or anything on top oversized and long and you're ready to go so that was it for today i hope you did enjoy it and i just want to thank you guys for watching my videos and if you are new here remember to subscribe because i'm gonna be making more fashion videos thank you so much see you later bye